Well, the city's sewer workers have their hands full dealing with cockroaches. There are millions of those creepy crawlers in the city, and workers are doing what they can to keep them out of your neighborhood. Alex Tomlin went along to see the problem firsthand. A peek inside the city's sewer system, and you realize this is a problem. Cockroaches line the walls, and it's Vince Jaramillo's job to get rid of them. I consider myself a bug man. Jaramillo and his boss, Alfred Gallegos, took me to one of the most infested neighborhoods in the city, the UNM area. Cockroach has been an ongoing problem for, for years. Uh, right now, it's uh, our peak season. And the way to get rid of the critters? He has a lot of opening and closing manholes. Okay. Will do this dozens of times today. After the cover is off, the paint goes in. Come up, take a quarter turn. The white paint is really a chemical to dry out and kill the cockroaches. And they spray it in about 150 manholes a day, all in response to calls to the Water Authority's cockroach hotline. The paint works in less than an hour and lasts about a year, but that doesn't mean the cockroaches are history. It's a 50 50 battle. Uh, sometimes we win, sometimes we lose. One place cockroaches are winning the war against the city are underneath meter covers like these, where sewage inspectors can't spray because the chemicals could end up in our drinking water. Neighbors in this area get that there's only so much workers can do. I'd rather have cockroaches messing with, with my water than chemicals, I think. Chanley Jackson says cockroaches are everywhere. A big family of them live on my porch, and that's where they get in. I see them mating and running around all the time, and we sing the cucaracha song to them. Gallego says some of the insects can be three or more inches long and even fly. Some of our customers say that uh, they can put saddles on them and ride them off. But Gallegos and Jaramillo won't stop trying to win the war, even if they know they're severely outnumbered. How many cockroaches do you think are in this city? Millions. Alex Tomlin. KRQE News 13. Pretty good estimate. Other problem areas for cockroaches, Knob Hill and Ridgecrest areas, areas with older sewer lines and yards that are greener and more damp. Also, workers tell us the old sewer lines under Presbyterian Hospital are a favorite hangout for those bugs.